Hello everyone, welcome to Everything Football and welcome to another Champions League Fantasy Update video. Today we are going to be speaking about the Match Day 9 watch list. So two players that we should be keeping our eye on between now and next Tuesday. You don't necessarily have to buy them, but we should be keeping an eye on them. So let's get straight to it. First up, Andy Robertson. Now, this is a player we never usually consider. In fact, at the moment, is only owned by 5%. And that is because most people have Trent Alexander-Arnold, who is currently injured. So um, do I think Alexander-Arnold will play in the Premier League this weekend? I don't think so. And in the Champions League, he could make it, but he could be subbed off, depending on how that game goes. That is because that weekend, that following weekend, Liverpool will play against Manchester City in a crucial game. So. Andy Robertson, I think, is guaranteed 90 minutes um, against Benfica, or at least 80 minutes. He's played nearly every single game, apart from uh, one, if I'm not wrong, against uh, uh, or two. Match day six, he didn't play against uh, AC Milan, and also he didn't play against Atletico Madrid, but he's always very consistent to get my point. Whatever Trent Alexander-Arnold can do, he can do as well. He basically can do as well. The assist, the clean sheets. Liverpool have not kept that many clean sheets in the Champions League this season. It's going to cost you only 6.4 million that is even cheaper than trent alexander arnold so i think this is a guy we should definitely be keeping our eye on he's not as expensive as trent trent might not play in that game because they have man skin next up and uh 22 points so far for robertson this season he's picked up one assist he's got one clean sheet this season uh, 25 balls rec uh, ball recoveries which have, uh, have got him seven points and he's also on corners on free kicks so definitely a very good option so andy robertson is the first choice Next up, Thomas Muller. Now, just like Andy Robertson, we usually consider someone else when we're speaking about uh, Bayern Munich, and that is Lewandowski. Usually not many people go for Muller. People go for Lewandowski, Neuer, Kimmich, Sane, those kind of players. But Muller has only actually missed one game this season in the Champions League, only one. And when he starts, he plays nearly every single 90 minutes. I think when he starts, it's only once where he's played like 84 minutes or something and he got subbed off. He always plays and he usually scores as well. Like I watched Germany the other day, Thomas Muller's on the score sheet. He's way cheaper than Lewandowski, 9.8 million. I'm not saying he's an alternative to Lewandowski. I'm saying if you think they're going to get a couple of goals against Villarreal, which I think, I think they're going to get like three goals in the first leg and maybe another three in the second leg. I think Muller and Lewandowski will both be helping each other out, scoring and assisting. Last match day, Thomas Muller got 11 points against Salzburg. He scored two goals. So far, this season is picked up um, a total of um a total of 41 points 15 ball recoveries four goals scored two assists so 41 points is not that bad i know Lewandowski is like on the 80s but i mean that is not too much different from the players we usually go for uh, the midfielder so thomas Mull is a guy i'm definitely considering very very much so 9.8 million villarreal away from home that is a guy to watch out for especially when they play over the weekend let's see if they're going to be rested or stuff like that so very, very good options there. Um, let me know which of the two you would try and consider bringing into your team. I might end up with both, um, depending whether Alexander Arnold is totally ruled out of the game. And I currently have Jesus in my team. So if I'm going to replace Jesus, it might be with Thomas Muller. So I already did a team selection video, I'll link it up in the YouTube guide right now. You can go and check that out as well. Let me know which of the two players you're interested in. Thank you for watching. Hit the like button and I'll catch up with you guys on the next one.